Hey guys, how's it going? We're back here with episode 6 of the Minnesota Wild, be it GM mode or franchise mode or whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, we're about to turn it to September where we'll start the preseason and whatnot. Right? Yeah, preseason should start. It'll come up, I'm sure. Uh, let's just sim to the first and... See if that's where it pops up. I know it pops up at some point. So we're selling a lot of season tickets. 95% to be exact. Wondering when that's gonna maybe after this. Uh, I want to earn at least seventy nine percent of my forty seven point seven million expected proper uh, profit. I want us to win our regular season home opener. I want us to boost team chemistry by 5 to 70. We need more parking for the arena. So play us, playoff hopeful, I will expect us to compete for a playoff spot. However, if we don't make the playoffs, we need to ensure our fans are happy with the direction of the team. Um, let's just set some captains here. Koivu captain, Parise, alternate, suitor, alternate. That feels right. Numbers seem solid too. Let's edit some lines here. Um, so this is what we got right now. Niederreiter. Reinhardt is an 87, so I think he takes over for <laughs> Niederreiter easily on that first line. Um, I would like Parise to still be up there. I'd like this. We got Coil Coolen and Gianta. Um, Beagle's going to be on that foot. We're going to replace Ferraro with... Heck. And we're going to throw Gianta onto that fourth line. So Kuhlman, Coil, Erickson, Eck. I think that will be a pretty good third line. Um, can always seek some upgrades. Uh, could always seek um, a different first line left winger. Um, we'll see if Parise is dealable. It's just a contract like... Uh, he's 34. He got a little better last season just because he played really good, but uh, seven more years, so that takes him to what? When he's 41, he's going to be crap by then. So maybe we're looking to trade him this season, um, trying to get a better left winger. Uh, Kuhlman, Coyle, Erickson, Eck, like I said, probably solid third line. JT Miller, Koivu, and Nita Ryder, I think, is a really solid second line. So I think our top six is great right now, with the exception of possibly trading Parise. Um, and, you know, package deal with Parise involved for another left winger, if at all possible. Um, and Kuhlman's good, but... I mean, if he could be bumped down to the fourth, that's not too bad. Uh, but we're going to see how this third line does. Fourth line, Falingo, Beagle, Gianta. I think that's pretty good. Um, I like Beagle, the addition of Beagle. And Gianta is not bad. He's a, obviously a rental, but we will, uh, so we'll have to figure out something uh, next time around. Let's look at special teams. Um, yeah, I think that's okay. Um... Yeah, I'm fine with how that turned out, honestly. Penalty kill, Beagle, Kuhlman, Koivu, Erickson, I like that as well. Stalk down to 75, which is not that fun. Um, so we might have to pick up a backup goalie after all. Um, but I think those are the lines we're going to roll with, guys. Um, but we didn't check out defense, so let's just do that really quick for her to do that. 
defense. Sewer so Brodeen, Dumba Spurgeon. Dumba's up to an 84, so that's good to see. Um, Davidson, Riley Davidson, we added from free agency last episode. Um, so I think a pretty solid acquisition there. I think our defense is pretty set right now. Uh, nothing needed to add there. Um, let's go scouting. Uh, we'll do what we usually do. I think we should start with goalies, though, because we do need a goalie. I'm thinking we need to draft a goalie. Um, we can quickly look in free agency just to see what there is for backup goalies. Costello got a 75 I'm not too pumped about. But the best out there is a 76. So he's a high backup. Uh, probably five years old. Might not be bad to add to the pool. He only wants a year and he wants cheap. So I think that's definitely doable. And um, it's also uh, check out what the AHL is doing here. Let's get Kyle Simon Laco there on the fourth line. Don't mind that. I'm glad that's like the default. We got Berg Fors Watt and Hay there too, so they'll be you know getting some time improving. Bergfors there on the power play. Caught and Bergfors on the penalty kill. Walters is scratch. Um, not exactly what you like to see, but that's okay. I'm not going to bother like editing those just because... Um, Because it's just when there's an injury, I don't want to be coming through that and editing that every time. I'm more concerned with the NHL team right now. Um, so yeah, let's in the preseason. Offer accepted. Sweet. Okay, budget. Always put that arena up because we're gonna have to do some stuff with that. Uh, auto assign the permissions. I don't mind too much about that. Scouting goalies the first time around. Um, please designate before October 3rd. All right, so let's just take a look. Protein with the most points. Um, what are you looking at? All right, so now we're a contender. We've been updated to a contender. Um, believe we needed to upgrade a parking lot. So let's just get that out of the way. Yeah, on your goal requirement. Just do it now. Make them happy. So yeah, not the best preseason, but that's okay. Um, I will throw who we just added as our backup. Looks like Suter has a minor injury. Can 
he can improve, especially if he's in this backup. Cool. So yeah, it's in the first month here. Same in the home opener. Ah, uh, well. Not off to a good start, though. Beat the former champions in overtime. Uh, let's see, Ben Davidson has been injured with a mild concussion. Since he's on the last line, I'll just have the assistant coach replace him. Players want to meet Coil. No impact with the demanding team. Sub him back in myself. Six one win, not bad, not bad. Brian Gianta again, just I'll replace him because he's on the fourth line. Injured. I was in Iowa, so I don't mind just doing the best lines. Multiple players back. So six and six in even five hundred after October. We'll take a quick look at the stats. Cleveland leading us in points. Need a rider. Erickson Eck is up there again. Coyle and Erickson Eck doing good in that third line. Reinhardt on the first line. Coolman so that. Third line is definitely doing good. Parise not doing so hot. Um, probably just going to toss him on the trade block right now. Like, to see Miller step it up. So we'll do that really quick. Um... Don't need Beagle up there.
So yeah, looking for another top six would be good. We'll take another first. Don't need more of that. I'd like to hold on to this pick. I'll throw a second rounder up there though. Cool, so let's continue the sim. It's really not doing that good, so we're going to need to edit something. There's only one goalie there, so I'm only going to go one week. Could claim Rob O'Gara. Not going to, though. Nine goalies here, so we'll go to two weeks. Reinhardt injured. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's try that. And suddenly with that injury, we're not doing too bad. Again, we gotta go best lines and do this big switch around. Oh, did they throw Ekin on defense? Yeah, what the hell? Oh, because we got Dumba injured too? So then we're going to need to do roster moves. Olsen's lucky day. Two shutouts in a row. Suitors back. Um, let's see where there are more goalies. Fine. 
alive here. So it's an old sim back down. Lines to get Dumba in Miller. When so we have uh, turned things around in November. Niederreiter leading us in points, and we're atop the uh, central division. So how about that? Granlin up there, Coil up there, Koivu, Eriksenek. Pretty good, doing all right. So doing pretty solid here. Like I said, atop the central. Definitely take that after a horrendous first month. Looks like we got stuff to do in our uh, maintaining of the stadium, but we'll get to that. All right, we'll go to forwards now. Thing. All right. Six nothing win against Pittsburgh. Coolman injured, mild concussion. St. Louis will um hmm, seventy four two. Miller's injury so it looks like Erickson Eck will get on that second line now. Coolman is back though. Isn't he already in? Yeah. All right, let's upgrade real quick or maintain or whatever you gotta do.
Just gonna repair all this now. Let's go with the stats. All right, now fourth in the central. Niederreiter on top, Koivu, Grand, then Reinhardt, Parise, Brodine, Erickson, Eck drop down a bit. Plus 14 for Brodine, well. Uh, we'll quickly look at uh, Dominic's doing two. Oh, both of them are doing really solid. in January 2 before wrapping it up. Now Coil's injured. So yeah, I think... Hmm. Had defense on the fourth line. We'll just do that for now because I think an injury will be up soon. Especially with a full week here without games. I'd like JT Miller come back. And there's Coil. I think in the next episode we'll like analyze the scouting a bit more so see where the top prospects are right now and then like scout them even more. Flingo's on the fourth line, right? Yeah, he is, so we can just replace him. Let's just see how this player is. Eh, don't want to trade those picks for him. Oh, no, 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 no. Forgot to edit that first line, too. One more game. All right, 26, 16, and 10. Be nice to be winning some more overtime slash shootouts. 
it's kind of the difference maker right now. Um, but we are third in the Central Division, so we do currently have a spot in the playoffs. Just barely. Chicago has a game in hand, only behind by four points. Niederreiter still leading the way, and he's on that second line. So maybe we do give him first line minutes. We consider that. Grant and Reinhardt doing solid as well. So yeah, maybe we do bump Parise down. Give Niederreiter that left wing. So if Parise, Koivu, and Miller be our second line. So you're Brodin doing good, Erickson Eck. Um, and we'll look at his full career statistics. How did he do last season again? 37 points. So I don't know if he's quite going to make it there this season. But he doesn't have... He has Coil as his center instead of Koivu. So, uh... Yeah. But how is Niederreiter doing compared to... So he's on pace to have a really good year, um, probably better than last season. How about Reinhardt? Definitely on pace for a better year than last season. How about Grandland? Um, that's going to be close. Probably not as good, but uh, we'll see what happens if we edit those lines a bit. Alright guys, so yeah, we'll handle the rest of the sim in the next episode. Probably take a look at a Parise trade at the deadline, or we might hold off on that until the draft too, depending on how we're doing. Take a look at the calendar. So yeah, here's the trade deadline, March, April, yeah, so we'll get through the next bit. And the next one. See ya. Adios.